Hello Year 5, welcome back. Today we are going to learn Unit 7, Study Skills, taken from textbook page 63. Today we are learning Language Arts and this is our fourth lesson for Unit 7. So what do we need today? We need your Year 5 English textbook. So from your textbook, page 63, we can see that this is a chant. But before we go into the chant, we are going to read first. And teacher is going to explain to you. So the title for today is Adventures with Books. Do you know what is an adventure? Adventure is exciting things that you can do. For example, if you watch movies, it's going up the mountain or going into the deep blue seas. It's very exciting. Now, let us go into the text. Books are ships that sail the seas to land or snow or jungle trees. Storybooks can bring us across the sea and sometimes through storybooks we can read about snow or even stories about jungles. And I'm the captain bold and free. Who will decide which place we'll see. This is the captain. If you read from the storybook, sometimes you read about captain stories, pirates and sailors. Even though we haven't been on a ship before, or we haven't seen what is a sailor or pirates before. Books are trains in many lands, crossing the hills or desert sands. I'm sure many of you or most of you have not been to desert sands before. So books can bring us to these places. And I'm the engineer who guides the train on its exciting rides. So if you're reading the books, it can bring you to many places. Sometimes the story is very exciting. Books are zoos that make a home for birds and bees not free to roam. Bees are all the other animals, any other creatures. So sometimes some very dangerous animals that you couldn't see but you can read from your books. And I'm the keeper of the zoo. I choose the things to show to you. Books are gardens, fairies, elves, cowboys and people like ourselves. I'm sure you love storybooks about fairies and elves and all these magical creatures. And I can find with one good look just what I want inside a book. You can find all things from a book. Now let us answer some questions. So from the chan just now, we can answer some questions. Let's look at the first one. We can travel to far away places. Which lines tells you this? So from the chan, which line does it show that the author can go far away places? It's in line 4 and 5. Who will decide which place we'll see? Books are trains in many lands. Question 2. 
Which verse tells you that reading helps you to learn about animals? In which verse? That's in verse 3. Books are zoos that make a home for birds and bees not free to roam. And I'm the keeper of the zoo. I choose the things to show to you. Here, the verse is talking about birds and bees. Bees are creatures or animals. Question 3. Which lines tell you that reader can choose what he or she wants to read? It's in line 15 and 16. And I can find with one good look just what I want inside a book. So you can find anything from a book. Now let's chant. The title of our chant, Adventures with Books. Are you ready? Let's go! Books are ships that sail the seas To land or snow or jungle trees And I'm the captain, bold and free Who will decide which place we'll see? Books are trains in many lands Crossing the hills or desert sands And I'm the engineer who guides The train on its exciting rides Are you ready? Let's go! Books are zoos that make a home For birds and bees not free to roam And I'm the keeper of the zoo I choose the things to show to you Books are gardens, fairies, elves Cowboys and people like ourselves And I can find with one good look Just what I want inside a book That's all for today. I hope you enjoy the chant. See ya. Bye.